Hi, I'm Auri Katarina and I deep clean people's homes for free. Homes like this. This home is full of trashes, grime and stains. And look at that! This shower is perfect. It's so dirty. Because for me, the dirtier, the better. This bathroom is one of the dirtiest one I have ever seen or cleaned. <laughs> and yes, I wanna clean it so badly. I wanna wash it and scrub it and rinse it. Oh my god. Oh, look at that. Ooh, and a spider friend. <laughs> Next, I wanna show you this living room. It is perfect. I mean, it is perfectly dirty. One thing you cannot see on the video is the smell. This house smells horrible. And sadly I noticed that this house owner Nick doesn't have a bed. But instead he has a lot of cat food. I mean a lot of. <laughs> That's why I named this place Lats. Nick and his cat have lived here for many years. It's so hard to understand, how is that even possible? But I will tell you Nick's story a bit later. And today I'm not alone, because I'm cleaning with my brother Santeri. Hello! This is Santeri's first time cleaning a house like this, so we will hear his thoughts really soon. Coming up in this video, really super satisfying cleaning, but this time we are also facing some problems while cleaning. Let's start! So, Santari, are you having fun? Oh, uh, well, uh, yeah, I think so. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, the smell is really bad, but I'll, I think I'll get used to it. Picking up the trash looks so easy when you do it on the video. When you do it here, it's so gross. No, it's not gross. Okay, maybe a little. <laughs> yeah, it is. Like when you pick up something, all the bugs and the maggots and the smells, they all come to life. Yeah, it is sad to think that somebody, in this case Nick, is living here. I always think that I'm here just this one day, smelling this and touching these things. But Nix has to live here every single day. I will throw these pillows away and bought a new ones because these are moldy. Nobody can sleep with these. If your mental health is not okay, it can cause many kind of problems. That's why this video is sponsored by BetterHelp. I think now is a good time to talk a little bit about mental health. How is your mental health? My mental health is really good, because I have been in therapy for many years, and it is the one thing why I am doing so well in these days. And if you are struggling, you are not alone. It's really difficult to prioritize mental health if you don't even know where to begin. That's why this video is sponsored by BetterHelp. BetterHelp is a customized online therapy that offers video, phone and even live sessions with your therapist. So you don't even have to see anyone if you don't want to. There is a broad range of expertise in BetterHelp's over 20,000 therapist network that gives you access to help that may not be available in your area. You just fill out a questionnaire to help assess your specific needs. And then you are matched with the therapist in under 48 hours. Then you schedule secure video or phone sessions. Plus you can exchange unlimited message and everything you share is completely confidential. For me, therapy has given confidence and I feel like I'm controlling my life. I can't be happy if my mental health is not okay. You can also request a new therapist without no additional charge, so don't worry if you don't get the perfect match on the first try. So many people use BetterHelp that they are currently recruiting additional therapists in all 50 states. 
Join the 2 million plus people who have taken charge of their mental health with BetterHelp. Sign up for BetterHelp, H-E-L-P, through this link in my description and enter my promo code AUDIKATARINA to get 10% off your first month and take the first step towards better mental health. This house owner Nick suffers from depression, so it's really good that he and his cat asked our help. Clean home is one thing that affects your mental health. Because when you come home and it's clean, your thoughts are clearer and cleaner. Let me tell you a little bit about my brother Sandari. So our mom has a cleaning company, so we both have worked there. So that's why Santari knows exactly how to clean. <laughs> Our mom's company provides cleaning services for other companies. So we have cleaned shopping malls, nursing homes, halls and offices. Santari knows all the cleaning techniques, like how to use scraper, how to fold a microfiber cloth and so on. <laughs> And he came all the way here with me to clean Nick's apartment for free. That's amazing. Wow, look at this. Oh, I think this is dust and spider web. Hmm, this is a little bit of sticky, so that's why I'm spraying glue remover on top of it. So now the cloth is gliding there. It looks so much boring now. <laughs> Have you ever tried to use a dish brush with your furniture? Because look, it collects all the hair. It is super easy and satisfying technique at the same time. The house owner Nick was suffering from depression and I think he had some kind of drinking problem also. Nick has a good job but after the workday he's really tired because all the energy goes into working. When you are depressed many times you don't have that much energy. Nick tries to drown his sorrow into computer games. When he is at home he can't and won't think about the mess. But of course, sometimes he has to. His cat is the most precious thing in his life. And the cat loves him no matter what. He tries to take such a good care of it. Depression can be like dirty scrap daddy. The other side is filthy and sad, feeling like trash. But people many times only show the other side, the clean side and try to hide the dirty side. People are masters hiding their mental illness. I have noticed that there are a lot of similarities in these houses. People eat poorly because they can't cook. They buy stuff to feel better. They have money problems, so a lot of times they are in debt. Men usually spend their money on electronics and games. The women on jewelry and cosmetics. They also have a lot of clothes, they don't sleep well, and they don't have that many friends. And of course their houses are like landfills. They are desperate to find something good in their life. Shopping, drugs, alcohol, fast food, you name it. They try to find something to feel something. That's why I try to break this circle. If I can clean their house and then they can start to cook. So they could eat healthier and have more energy and hopefully even sleep better. Or then they will notice that asking for help was a good thing. So they will ask it again and go to therapy, for example. Usually negative things keep piling up and positive things can keep piling up as well. It's some sort of love of nature. Also dust collects the dust easier. That's how dust bunnies are created.
So this guy doesn't even have a bed. I tried to find a bed for him. So let's hope. Because I feel so bad that he is sleeping on the couch. Okay, at this point I found a bed. And I was so relieved. But nobody couldn't deliver it for us. Oh, but luckily we have still time to try to find someone who could do that. My brother Sander is googling all the companies that could deliver it for us. Wish him luck and meanwhile let's clean this sink. Here I'm using Scrub Daddy's dish wand. It's so cute. Potato. It looks like potato. <laughs> this sink looks grey and lifeless. But first I'm washing it with dish soap. So let's see what dish soap can remove. Enjoy! Okay, looks pretty good to me. Let's rinse it. I think it came really good only with dish soap. What do you think? <laughs> yeah. I think the sink is happy, so let's move on. Scrub Daddy's turn to wash the dishes. But wait a minute, this looks interesting. Mm. I think this is something burnt stuff, but I'm not sure. Mm. But it comes off pretty easily with scraper. Okay, that's it. Let's wash the rest of it. I think I'm gonna use Scrub Daddy's Multi Surface Spray and a steel daddy of course because steel daddy is a harder tool than scrub mommy so that's why it removes all the burnt things like that <laughs> it works like magic let me show you how you can clean your induction stove first i'm starting with dish soap and scrub daddy I'm just spreading the dish soap all over there. Then I start to scrub it. Scrubbing removes all the burnt circles. Then I scrub it again and then I wipe it clean. So now it's deep cleaned. This counter has some good stains, so let's scrub those off. This shop is a really good product because it removes grease and all the stickiness away. I definitely recommend using it to clean your kitchen and also the toilet or bathroom. <laughs> Here I had a really bad stains, like really sticky. So I sprayed oven cleaner and I waited like 15 minutes. And 15 minutes later, I'm scrubbing it off. But as you can see, I'm scrubbing it really hard, even though I let it take effect for quite some time. But now it's clean. There's a microwave! <laughs> I didn't see that. This table is so badly stained that I... <laughs> I just choose to use oven cleaner right away. We don't have much time, so I have to work really fast. 
That's why sometimes I use a really harsh chemicals so they affect immediately. And yep, we still haven't heard anything about the bed delivery. All the companies are saying that they can deliver it so quickly and I totally understand. I understand. But we are still working on it. I'm not giving up hope. Ooh, I really like to organize cabinets. It is super relaxing when things are in order. I go through the cabinets and throw away anything that has gotten bad. Cabinets like this doesn't usually have that bad stains inside of it, so that's why I'm using some kind of multipurpose spray to clean it. When I'm putting everything back, I try to figure out what the house owner uses the most. When your cabinets are clean, it affects your mind. Because when you open a cabinet and it's in order, organized, it calms your mind. It's not full of stuff, you know. <laughs> I don't mean that everything should be in order all the time. But I mean, it's good if the cabinets or drawers are not crowded with stuff. Then you feel lighter in your home. Like here, it looks lighter. I'm potato and I'm ready to scrub. Did you know that these brown marks are from fruit flies? They come off easily by using dish soap. Alright, I have no idea what this is. Kind of salt? I think. Why is there so much salt on the floor? Well, I don't know about now, it's gone. Let's wash this kitchen floor and then I can go and clean the bathroom, the shower. Ooh. Mm. And just for you know, we haven't heard anything about the bed delivery. Nobody is answering us. I'm kind of desperate. At this point, I was thinking that maybe we have time to rent a van so we could get it ourselves. But on the other hand, it really takes a lot of time and I want to clean this home completely. And we can't stay here for another day because Sundari has to go to work, so... I don't know. I mean, I don't want to complain, but I still want that bed here. <laughs> Some of my followers are trying to find someone close by who could deliver the bed here. So let's see, but let's move on to the bathroom really soon. That dirty, moldy, black shower wall is waiting for me. And I'm waiting for it also. Of the companies called us back and said that they can deliver it. So woohoo! I'm so happy and relieved. We have the bed, Monique. It was like a miracle for us when this company called us and said that they have some kind of cancellation. So 
they could bring us their bed. <sighs> I have never been so happy. Like I'm cleaning this super super dirty bathroom and I have a bed coming here so this makes me so happy. Like you can't buy feeling like this. Okay, but now let's talk a little bit about the shower wall. This grime is mold and grease and something brown. But I think the mold has grown there. Hmm. <laughs> I'm removing it with scraper and dish soap. Surprise, surprise. For the grout, I'm using a steel daddy. <laughs> Look how black it is. <laughs> oh, this rinsing part. Mm. Ah, my soul is resting. Sadly, this sink was broken, so that's why we are doing teamwork and Santer is holding the sink, so I can clean it. Let's start washing it with dish soap and scrub mommy. Mm. Yeah, scrub it real hard. Then comes the satisfying part really soon. Before that, I'm using a steel daddy because it removes all the hard stains. And now they're rinsing. Mm. Okay, there's still something left, so that's why I'm using acid-based product. There is, I think, rust and lime scale. Also, what would you guys want to learn? Like, do you want to learn different kind of stains or tools or anything? Please let me know in comments. Woohoo! It's super wide! Yay! Deepadi stepadi do magic trick. Woohoo! Yo ho, these clothes are wet and moldy and they smell bad. But still, I'm enjoying every minute of it. Every minute of it. I mean, every minute of it. Here I'm collecting treasures. Almost like dresses, but no, they are treasures. Ooh, wet cardboard. Yummy. Mmm, mold. Yummy. <laughs> and dirt. Doop. This is tile floor, so it's really easy to clean. And at least in Finland we can rinse all the bathroom floors, so that makes the cleaning 
really easy. Mm. There's something stuck in there. But I have this large scraper. Pro tip! When you wash the bathroom floor, wipe it before rinsing it. It makes the rinsing so much faster, since the soap is not foaming. Last but not least, let's clean this drain. Here I'm using dish soap and a toilet brush. This collects all the hair so they don't end up in the sewer. Guys, the bed is here! <laughs> I'm so happy! I'm so happy! These guys were wonderful. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this is true. <laughs> guys, imagine, he has a bed now. <laughs> this is so awesome. Now let's make the bed. Oh my God, I can't imagine how Nick feels when he comes home and he can sleep in his own bed. That is so... Oh, I don't know what, what word can describe that feeling. <laughs> so Sandari, did you enjoy the cleaning? <laughs> well, I think I did. Usually I don't like cleaning on my own, but this time it was great. Especially seeing the house owner's reaction. Yeah, that is super nice. It is so heartwarming to do these cleanings for these people. I love it. So that's why I have to go. Because the next dirty home is waiting for me. See you then. Bye bye. So let's hope, because I feel so bad that he is sleeping on the couch. So let's see, but I'm hopeless, but I'm hopeless, but I'm hopeless.